There's someone peeking out the front of their house. They're having a look out their front door. I'm tempted to uh, disturb them just for uh, to see them pull that hatch in, but, <laughs> but I better not. Nice hatch it's made. I better not disturb it. Well, I think it's a puffball. I'm not sure. I think if we were a toadstool, it would have been up, but would have pushed itself up by now. I think it might be a puffball. I'm not an, a mycologist. I'm just sitting there. Looks a bit like a golf ball. Except it's too big now. Just sitting there, not doing much. Just listening to the wind like I am and the birds. Let's get a bit closer to it. That's what it looks like. Puffball thing. Almond blossoms eventually turn into almonds. Soon the cockatoos will eat them all. They'll have some nice food, won't they? They like them when they're a bit greenish still. Won't be long before they're taking them. Nice almonds. Beautiful almonds. Everything's glistening after the rain. Even old broke back mountain is glistening. There it is, glistening in the distance. I can see a bird up there. Are they convolvulus or something? I scattered those seeds here years ago. I collected them near Forbes somewhere. That's right, I collected them near Cotton's Weir. And now they're growing here as well. I do that sort of thing with plants that I like. Some sort of convolvulus, I think. Pretty little thing. Sweet very drought resistant too and they can climb up fences. They look lovely all cascading over a fence. Smile for the camera little one. Two, four, five. Look how beautiful and geometric it is. Geometric cowl it is. It's so like a little mandala. So well designed. So beautifully designed. 